Hey, this is Nana from Tracking202, and in today's video, I'm going to do a quick overview of everything that's new in the Prosper202 click server that we just launched. Notice the new interface. Let's sign in. A new start page with reduced applications into the Prosper202 click server. On the overview tab, brand new look and feel here. The reportings have changed. Notice the new rotator overview, and I'll show you what that means later on. Let's go to setup, which you'll be hanging out at. We added a new pixel type here, which is a raw pixel. Let's take a look at some of these new tabs. A lot of it include stuff that you're used to, but just redesigned to look much better. I hope you enjoy the new look and feel here. advanced pixels, universal smart pixels, rotator, this brand new rotator, notice that you can redirect based on lots of different factors. We'll just create a new test one and take a look, but obviously I'm not going to show you everything. You can play around with this later and I'll also make a separate tutorial that will go over this. In the analyze tab, we've added much more stuff here, notice the countries, regions, cities, ISP carrier, device and browser and platform reports. The visitor view on the user agent spot, you'll see breakdown by device type as well. So for example, if it's a crawler or a bot, you'll notice a different icon. We've got flags for the geo, ISP carrier information, and then the usual stuff that you're used to. That's also in spy view. Update tab is pretty much the same. Featured resources, brand new partners have been included on this page. New look and feel here. Personal settings, lots of time zones for you to choose from. The ability to cache reports if memcache is installed. API keys for the new Prosper 202 reporting API. This lets you run reports on your Prosper with an API call. Click server API key is used to manage all Prosper 202 accounts. I'll show you more later. VIP perks profile, you should have already seen this. If you're new to Prosper, say yes, and we have a built-in guide that will guide you through a lot of the features of Prosper as you click around for the first time. Tell us the traffic sources that you work with, the affiliate networks that you work with, and we'll send you directly personalized offers, services, and anything else that will help you grow your business. And all of that, it's matched up directly to your profile. Click server management, as we talked about, you can manage all your click servers in one spot. This feature is only available to people on the hosted platform right now. Eventually, it will be open to anyone else so that you can see all the prosper domains that you have in one spot and manage them from one area. Third-party API integrations. Right now, we've got ClickBank. We will have much more in the future. We're working on a Cake and a Has Offers integration. So if you have a network that runs on Cake or Has Offers, very soon you'll be able to pull in your offers automatically, put, place your pushback pixels, uh, apply to run offers, and much more all inside of Prosper. Sessions page, we added a way for you to choose a date range, actually the date pre prior to what you want your clicks to be deleted. This will be clicks deleted prior to May 1st. You can turn on your MaxMind ISP carrier lookup database. If you put in 202 config slash geo folder, we'll be able to use that for ISP carrier lookup information. This is a paid service, so you'd have to purchase this database. Help section, pretty much the same. The new thing is a new help dot tracking to a two domain over here. You take a look and we'll see that we're adding more sections into this area right now, but you'll be able to go through some of the help that we've already created. And this is going to get filled in more and more. If you have a question, type it in here. If you don't see an answer, 
That means that we haven't answered it yet, but you can send us an email and we'll be able to create that answer so that you and everyone else can see it. Over here is the built-in help system that we have included in the new Prosper. You can use this to message me and the rest of the development team directly. And if you find any bugs or issues or anything that's urgent, you can use that. We also have a premium help and support service that we're launching soon. And this is how we'll be able to interact with you one-on-one. -on -one. Right now though, this help and support feature is open to anyone. So as long as we haven't launched that feature, you can use that to request help and support and see how that feels and works for you. And then when it's time, you'll be able to upgrade. Anyway, that's the brief um, quick walkthrough of the new Prosper 202. You can download it at prosper202.com and we hope you enjoy using this as much as we enjoy creating it.